Yo, what has been going on YouTube? This is your boy Mickey CTX reporting to you. Well, after a week of being MIA, I bet you some of you, because I got some messages like, hey Mickey, where the heck have you been? We're used to your videos every day. It kind of, uh, you know, some people were even disappointing at, you know, disappointed at the whole th the reason that I wasn't even on. And I will apologize, guys. It's the whole school semester. It is kicking my ass. Woo! Now that's over with. I'm going to be playing here with a buddy of mine, actually from the YouTube community. His name is ING Selena Gomez. Actually, if you look at his clan tag, it says Banging Selena Gomez. And now he has a YouTube channel. I will post it on the annotations right about now. Right there. Okay, so check his channel out. He's a really cool dude. He's a great gamer. Does not camp one bit like I do. He's also no camping necessary. Uh, I don't know if my video inspired him or he's just been inspired by luck. So, yeah, as you see me drop shot this guy, pull out this guy, uh, the little spaz, I think, the gun right there, the uh, shotgun. I think I lose this battle. But I guess uh, I didn't. So, yeah, so sorry about being in my again, guys. I have, uh, this school's really kicking my butt. And I'm going to tell you a little bit of the story of what's been going on. Now, before I continue, I hope you guys have a good weekend so far. I'm going to show you this gameplay. I, I was going to put it on Monday, but I figured, hey, you know, if you guys haven't seen a video in four days, I figured I'd put a good video on Saturday. Even though I know there's less people watching YouTube videos on Saturday, you know, I, I care about my subscribers, care about you guys, so I put a good gameplay. Now, uh, school. Alright, so I'm in, I'm in, um, I'm in at an actual university, and I'm taking these, uh, these classes, right? I'm taking four classes on the, in the actual, uh, campus, and I'm taking, uh, two online that I have to finish. I'm at another university, so I'm at two universities, uh, doing, uh, what people usually do in one university. And the reason I do that is because, um... They didn't let me take more than I wanted to for this semester, so I decided to go ahead and uh, get get to universities, you know, and just just finish my school. Uh, I'm just I'm just really desperate to get the hell out of school. You know, I hate it and whatnot. I, I love learning, but um, I, I I really just I hate how long it takes to get a degree. But hey, it's you know it's, it's gonna be worth it, you know. And uh, those those people that are going to college stay in school. Only because I hate school does not mean you should hate school and enough not to go. <coughs> Pardon me. So, um, so yeah, it's been taking up my time. I, you know, I'm, I'm actually, I don't even game as much. And, and I'm going to be done with this online school in three more weeks. And the rest is going to be, uh, because, you know, I'm, I'm triple major. So when you triple major, you have a ton of classes. And um, so I got to be in school most of the time. So this semester, I've, I've just been uh, overwhelmed with work. Uh, and, and it sucks because it's it's so much school work so much reading like for example uh, and uh, next Tuesday not not this Tuesday but the following so it's like two weeks from now basically I gotta turn in not turn in but I gotta read 19 chapters for one class for one of our um, one of our reports it's a short essay report it's about like maybe like six pages and I gotta do at least six pages of writing on this book so I gotta write I gotta read that and then I got some other crap I gotta do I gotta write I gotta read I think seven more chapters for another class and write some stuff for this debate it's, it's a lot of stuff so um it, it's uh yeah so you see me own this guy through the window i'm gonna tell you a little bit more about the whole school scenario so these three weeks that i that i have left that i have a, i i can't not drop uh one because i don't like to drop i have a good gpa i'm not a nerd or nothing but i i uh, i wasn't a good high school student and going into college was a way different mickey um i used to skip class i used to uh, you know, the thing about my high school years was that I lived right across the street from my high school. But when I mean right across the street, I was in walking distance, like maybe two minutes from the school. And I was right across the street, so everybody knew where I lived at. So I used to skip a lot because of the fact that um, it was right across the street. So my friends and I used to go into my uh, to my house and just, you know, we were bad, man. We used to drink, skip school. I, I was, and it's not that I was ever a dumb student. I was just a very, you know, liberal student. I was dumb for that reason alone. And I thought that was cool. And I made a ton of friends that uh, during my high school years. What is she doing? <laughs> okay, Melanie. But um, I, I, I ended up uh, going to college. I was that, that few that did really bad in high school. And I ended up going to college. And I did really, really well. Um, maybe not the first few years. Uh, I stopped going to college and just worked. And then I went back to college because I, you know, I already had credits. But I uh, went back for my second time. And I finished my associates, and then I was finishing my bachelor's, and now it's where I'm at now. So, um, trying to get where I'm, you know, trying to just finish the school stuff. 
uh, ready to make some good money and uh, not work so hard outside and least in the sun. But uh, yeah, so if you guys are going to go to college, please don't mess it up. It messes up your financial aid. I've known people that have gone to college and then they, they slack off like they're still in high school. I'm like, dude, you're in college. You're supposed to do better. Um, if I can do it, trust me, you can do it. I, I'm not the sharpest knife in the in, in, in the box, and uh, but I just work really hard for what I got. Kind of like Call of Duty, like I was never the best player, and I, I don't think I'm the best player still, but I, I do work hard to get that heart of a champion. And that's how I consider things mostly in life. Uh, I've always been the underdog in a lot of things. If you guys go to my introduction, I'll put, I'll put the uh, my first video up on the annotations on how I was always the underdog on everything I've ever done. But I always come on top. And again, that's what she said. <laughs> but uh, yeah. So I'm, I'm, I'm hoping you guys enjoy this gameplay. It's a little talk. It's a little bit of my high school slash college. And uh, hopefully this might inspire some of you guys that want to go to college. And my, my, I was that few that thought that college was not worth it. You know, college is really worth going if you're going to, you know, if, if, you're, if you don't want to work too hard outside. You know, you don't want to be a grass cutter or landscaper, then you go to college. You, you know, I'm like that. I don't like to work that hard and physically there's people that do you know and um, they're just people that that are like me that I'd rather just use my brain again that's what she said <laughs> uh, to make money because I I'd rather make good money you know than working outside really hard now if, if I was making millions of dollars a year like a gamer like Woody's Gamers Tag or I don't know if they make millions of dollars a year but you know they make good money if you know hey I probably would I would I would probably wouldn't even think too much about college but you also gotta remember that people like FPS Russia White Boy 7th Street uh, those channels are gonna fade one day and we gotta remember that it's gonna not always be as good as it is right now uh, so it's always good to have a backup plan it's like those athletes that go to the NFL you know they all have a college degree because they understand that you know that you can't depend on football uh, forever because you could get hurt same thing goes to uh, commentators you know it might be really good right now but it's because YouTube is so new they're making so much money People like me that are barely trying to make it, I have barely over 200 subscribers, but hey, I appreciate each and every one of you guys. But they they have you know millions of subscribers and they're banking, you know, they're they're rolling in those, rolling in the money, you know, cards into their homes, and you know, and that's they love to do that. That's good. And I'm not bashing on them, but I am saying that uh, damn, this guy keeps owning me with that shotgun. Um, but I am saying though, have a plan B, finish college, you know, do what you gotta do. If you gotta play a little bit less Call of Duty, trust me, Call of Duty's not gonna. Pay your bills. You gotta pay to play, actually. So even if you play PS3, you gotta pay that internet, man. God damn, God keeps owning me with that shotgun. Uh, so I'm right behind Selena Gomez. Uh, this guy, it was, it was really, it was an honor to play with this guy. This guy's one of the coolest cats I've ever met with, and he, he's probably a new friend of mine. I think I've met a new friend online from YouTube. So I appreciate him actually asking me if he could play with with me and my my team. He was a good addition to the team. And uh, it'd be kind of cool if he was actually in our clan, you know, but hey, if he wants to uh, be with his friend, that's cool too, you know. They have this team that's called ING Team. Uh, so um, I think they have like different celebrity girls that they would bang and then their clan tag is B-A-N-G, banging some celebrity. So it's pretty funny, kind of like pee on you. People are like, oh, pawn you, pawn you, oh, pawn you, whatever. You know, I'm like, dude, can you not freaking read? I mean, I don't, I don't put LOL and I don't say LOL, you know, but I do say LOL. So, <laughs> ING is banging, so that's pretty funny. The guy's a good player, and he doesn't camp. I like the fact, and he, you know, he actually did a commentary on the same exact video from this one video I'm showing you right now. And he was like one away from a Moab, and uh, one of my teammates robbed him from it. He, they, I mean, it wasn't on purpose. It was just like, you know, they both went for the same guy from a different distance, and my friend uh, from my clan beat him to the punchline. So, uh, it, was, <laughs> it was pretty funny. He was like, no! I was about to get my Moab. What the hell, man? What's going on with this? And I think it was that this game, and then two games after this, uh, he was also close to get a Moab. And, and it's pretty impressive if you're gonna begin a Moab, you know, two times almost, you know, back to back. That's pretty good, even if you don't get it. Uh, that's still a really high, you know, KDR. So um, the guy did his thing. He played with us, and uh, hopefully we'll play more, and you'll see more stuff with us. I'm gonna do a dual commentary with him really, really soon. Hey, and congrats on your job if you get it at that Sam's Club, bro. So if you see this video, give me your shout out. Love playing with you, man. You're a good guy. Get that job. Get that money. Get that HD PVR, and continue doing this YouTube thing, dude. So till next time, this is your heart of the champion. Hopefully you guys enjoy this video. 200 at the 129. Got a good KDR. Well, hopefully you guys have a good weekend. Till next time, this is your heart of a champion, Mickey CTX, signing off.